All right, so go ahead and start um, tapping side to side. I'm going to read to you um, what we're going to do today. This workout is cardio and strength. And uh, we are going to be talking about the attributes of God. Um, A.W. Tozer, in his book, The Knowledge of the Holy, says, What comes into our minds when we think about God is the most important thing about us. What comes into our minds when we think about God is the most important thing, thing about us. So when you think of God, what it means, it comes to your mind. Um, and Tozer is saying that is the most important thing about us. And as we move today throughout this workout, um, Heather with Revelation Wellness uh, posted uh, this beautiful post about names of God, what they mean. And because of that name, this is who I am. So I'm going to be uh, reading these out loud as we move. And the very first one I want to read is Elohim, creator, ruler, God. That is because he is the creator, ruler, God, I am created, sustained, and ruled. So God, we just thank you. Um, I just love saying the name, your name, God, because you have so many and you're so powerful and so good. Um, our minds cannot comprehend um, just your greatness and who you are. So God, I ask as we move our bodies today, as we train our minds um, on who you are and how that changes the way we live, think, and believe, God, I ask that you would do that. Um, keep us safe in your name. Amen. All right, so let's keep moving because we're going to warm up quick here. I am going to get some music for us. Here we go. All right, so go ahead and start marching. Roll your shoulders back. So those who are joining us right now in this moment, it's very early. So we are gonna wake up mind, body, and soul. <laughs> All right, switch directions, keep your feet moving. Get those arms bigger. Good. Go ahead and add a twist side to side here. Make sure you pivot that back foot. All right, let's get a little bit lower. So we will not be with the beat, and that's okay because it's a very fast one. And we're waking up, so just squat, pivot. Let that music be background noise right now. Don't worry about the beat. Squat, pivot, add a reach right here. Squat. Pivot. Good. Now take it up and over and tap. Reach and tap. Good. Four, three, two, one. All right, you can hold on to the wall or be here. Lift, or if you need balance, hold on to a chair, to a wall. Bring that leg up. Reach and tap. Right and left. Four, three, two, one. All right, go ahead. Lunge it back and curl. So curl up your arms as you lunge back. Right and left. Your option here for any lunge is squat, curl it up. Squat, curl it up. Got it. Three, two, we're gonna hold it right here. You can come all the way down or here, but reach right back down, getting that mobility, opening up the chest, getting that twist. Now you can stay high or low. One more, step it up, other leg back. Again, you can stay high, twist, or come all the way down. Rotate, rotate, eyes follow that hand. Four, three, two, one, step it up. March out, roll those shoulders out again. Go ahead and grab your hands in front, keep your feet moving. We're gonna get those shoulders by taking your hands, rotating all the way around your head. Switch directions, right here, other way. Good job. Three, two, one, here we go. Side step and tap. You got it, tap. Now, if you want to stay here, you can, or give me a little hop, get that 
heart rate up just a little bit, waking us up a little bit more. Whew. You got it. Four, three, two, one. All right, we're gonna open and close. Open and close, but you're gonna tap side to side. Open, close, and just bring that foot across the midline. All right, if you wanna pick it up, you can be here. Crisscross or keep that tap, okay? Three, two, one. March it out. Oh. Big arms again. Big arms, keep those feet moving. Switch directions. All right, now tap it side to side. Ooh, stay here, grab some water if you need it. We're gonna get going here. So for your first um, section of this workout, you're gonna go through these moves twice. And you go for 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Your first move, you're gonna go up, out. Okay, so it looks like this, out, up, out, okay? Um, for 45 seconds, you do not have to jump if you don't want to. You can tap it. All right, here we go for 45 seconds. So up, tap, up, tap, up, tap. Good. So you can be here and stay low if you want to leave out the jump. That's up to you. 45 seconds each move, 15 second break in between to catch our breath. Got it, good, great job. 15 seconds. So what we're talking about today, the names of God, what you think about God is the most important thing about you. All right, tap it out. We have 15 second recovery. You have three girls. You can be here, like pretending you're picking up your feet over something, or it's quick. Three to the right, three to the left. You ready? Here we go, 45 seconds. Other way. Now, if you're leaving out the jump, that's fine. Just make sure you're stepping over. All right, practicing stepping over. Three to the right, three to the left. Going back to that statement by A.W. Chozer. What comes to our mind when we think about God is the most important thing about us. When you think about God, what comes to your mind immediately? Ooh, and our first attribute, his name, Elohim, creator, ruler God. That is who he is. Ooh, break. All right. We got a burpee. <laughs> Option one, you can be here. Push up off the wall, give me four high knees, or give me the burpee, one, two, three, four, pop it up, don't worry about the jump. Ready, here we go. Pop it back or step it out, four, three, two, one, come up, or you're at that wall, give me a little squat, push up off the wall, four high knees. Nothing like a burpee to wake us up. So early in the morning. <laughs> Woo! You got it. Great job. 15 seconds. Less than 10. You're doing great. You're doing great. Four, three, two. There it is. All right. You got a square jump. You can step up. Step to the right, step it back, step to the left. So you're making a square. I'm gonna move this one with those handles. So you can step or you're here with me. Jump up, jump to the side, jump back to the left and back up. Here we go. To the side, jump or step. You can be here. Step, step, step. And you can stay low to target those legs. But you're making that 
square as you jump. Get your arms to help you. <laughs> you got this, good. So if you're here, just stay low. Target those legs, step up, to the right, back, side, up. You got this, four, three, two, Woo. All right, remember where, which way you went. We're gonna go the opposite a second time first. Grab some water. We're gonna start at the beginning. You got less than 15 seconds. And then a little longer break after this one. All right, here we go. Here we go. Ready? So up, tap, up, tap. Keep those arms out to the side. Get that mobility here, opening up the chest. When you tap, Good. Really good job. Second time through, we know it's coming. Stay consistent. Our name of God, Creator, Ruler God, because He is Elohim. I am created, sustained, and ruled. How does that change the way you think about God? How does that change the way you live? And you are created, sustained, and ruled. Great. Oh, let's get my heart rate up. Okay. We're gonna go to the right, three hurdles, and then to the left, back and back. Here we go, three, two, let's pick up your feet. Three, right, three left. Step or jump, you choose. 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Our next name of God is Yahweh, the self-existing I am. That's what Yahweh means, the self-existing I am. How does that change the way that we see him, the way that we live, is that we are chosen, dependent, and unchangeable. That is who he is and how we respond. Woo! All right. Sorry, talk about things. God, I'm making a break. All right. <laughs> Burpees for mountain climbers. Wall are coming down to the ground. You ready? Three, two, step or pop it back. Four, three, two, one. You come standing up, right up. You don't have to jump. You got this. Yahweh. Oh, the self existing I am, because that is who He is. I'm chosen, dependent, changeable. 15 seconds. 10 seconds. One burpee, four mountain climbers. Five, four, three, two. Ooh, break. Okay. We have the square jump. So remember which way you went the last time? You're going to go the opposite direction. Step or jump. Get ready to go in three, two, one. Step. Step to the side. Step it back. Or you're here. Up. To the side. Back. Just make sure you have space in your house. You're not going to trip on anything. You got room to jump up, to the side, back. Over halfway, right here. You're doing great. 15 seconds left. Good job. Less than 10, almost there. Three, two, why? Good job. Grab some water. Air high five. You did it. We're going to go to our strength portion. So make sure you got your dumbbells ready. And I think we'll do this together. I'll keep shouting it out, but if you uh, lose track of what you're supposed to do, I'll keep saying, this is what we're doing, but we have an AMRAP, five minutes. That means a 
as many rounds as possible. Let me get my timer here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna give me a squat and press. Now, if your legs aren't talking to you, like my friend on the other side of the camera, who did a lot of squats this week, you're gonna, you can leave out the squat and just give me the press, okay? But you're gonna give me 10 squats to a shoulder press. Then we're gonna do five on each side. You know, curtsy, center, give me that curl, curtsy, curl, that counts as one. We wanna get five on each leg. And then we're gonna get five lunges on each leg. You're gonna come down, lunge, row, kick back, back down. Okay, five each side. Then five on each side. You're gonna get a fly and lift. You're here, leg lift and a fly. If your balance feels like, um, you know, you're up a follower, then just stay here, leave out the lift. We need five here. Um, the lunge, if you feel it in your knees and you're here, and that's too much on my knees, then if you're okay, squat, row, kick back, okay? Take it to both legs. All right, here we go. Are we good to go? We good? All right, squat and press. We're going as many rounds as we can do in five minutes. Squat, press, give me 10. And I will keep shouting out the moves. So if you are ahead of me, just jump right into it. Ten total. After this, you're gonna give me that curtsy lunge, five on each side. Ooh, I lost track. Let's just do one more here. <laughs> All right. So five on each leg. Curtsy, come to center. Bicep curl. Curtsy. Now you can drop it to one dumbbell and hold one dumbbell and curl if you like. Five each leg. Make sure that front foot, those toes are straight ahead. We got this. Two more each side. After this, we got the lunge, row, kick back. Over a minute down already. All right, here we go. We're going to right leg back, lunge, come up, row, hold it, and then a kick back. Give me five each side. So lunge, stand tall, row, kick back, back down. Row, kick back. Don't rush through it. You got a lot going on in this move, so take your time. Once you hit five, we're gonna switch the other leg. All right, so lunge, stand tall, row, kick back. Down. Great job. Make sure you're breathing. Good, last one. All right, we got flies with the leg lift. So right leg is gonna lift or you keep it anchored to the ground. Put five, each side, lift. Once you hit five, you're gonna switch to the other side. Lift and fly. Ooh, set it down if you need to. Shake it out. We got a minute to 20 seconds left. Let's see what we can get through here. Squat and press, pretend. If you need to take that longer break, go for it. Exhale as you press up. You got one minute left. Good job. Once you hit 10, you get that curtsy to curl. Five on each side. All right, here we go. Curtsy, come to the center, curl it up. Other side, you got 30 seconds. Good. Our next name of God is El Shaddai. 
God Almighty, God of blessing and power, because he is El Shaddai, I am sustained, blessed, and provided for. All right, set it down. Your time is up. Oh, if you want to finish it, go for it. Or because our workouts are quick in the morning, we're going to go into our next hip workout. So grab some water. Same layout as before. 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off, but different moves. All right, so your um, second move is jump. Oh, not second move, second hit. Your first one is here, punch, jack, punch, or tap, punch, tap, punch, okay? 45 seconds. We'll get going here. Let me get my timer. All right, if you need more time, you take it. Just jump in when you're ready. But for 45 seconds, you got a jack and a punch. All right, you're here, or tap, punch, tap, punch. Back to that hit. You got it, good. Over halfway right here. El Shaddai. This is who God is, almighty, God of blessing and power. Because, of, because this is who he is, I am sustained, blessed, and provided for. All right, tap it out. Here's your next move. Knee out, knee up, out. Okay, so knee up, Knee out to the side, then we switch. Knee up, knee out to the side. You ready? Here we go. So you can leave out the jump. You can be here or you're here. If you want the jump up, out. Just be aware of your hips. If you're having a hard time getting your hips out to the side, they just can be tight. All right, so make sure that you are bone rolling, stretching doing all those good things to get that mobility in the hips. All right, so up, out, with or without the jump. You got this. Less than 10 seconds. Woo. Five, four, three, two. All right. Okay, we got another burpee. But you're gonna give me two kicks. So you can be here, push up off the wall with a kick, kick, or come down to the ground, pop it back or step it back. Come up, kick, kick. You ready? Here we go. Wall, jump, or step it back. You choose, kick, two kicks at the top, and then do it again. Kick, great job. Jump or step it back. You pick your option. Plenty of ways to do a burpee. All right. Do you listen to your body? You shut up. That's the hardest part. Right? Just showing up. You did it. Three, two. Oh, break. All right. We've got. Oh, man. Okay. What am I doing here? You know what? Come on down to the ground. We got a quick transition. Forgot to tell you that, so sorry. We're gonna do a sit up. So actually we're gonna roll our legs up, bring them down, touch our toes. Go up, our time started. I'll we'll show you your options. So roll up, touch your toes, or one, one leg out. One foot on the ground, hands behind the curve of your back, and you're here. Okay, you can be here. That's your option. Or lift, bring your legs down, touch your toes. Lift, legs down, touch your toes. I feel like this is a little kid's song. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. <laughs> Three, two, oh, you got 15 seconds to hop back up. Great job, I see you, you're doing awesome. All right, 
We're gonna start again, just tuck that. You're using your yoga mat, put it to the side. You got five seconds. We got the jack to a punch. So coming up and down off of that ground. Be careful, you're not getting dizzy, okay? So jump and jack, jump or tap, punch. Last time through, this is it for your workout for today, okay? Unless if you have extra time, you can go through that strength. A little arm wrap again for five minutes, that's up to you. Punch, jump, punch. You got it, or tap. 20 seconds left here. All right, our next name of God is Yahweh, and I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna butcher this name, but it's Yahweh. Is that whatever it means? The Lord of Hosts. That's what it means. Lord of Hosts. Tap it out. 15 second break. Because He is Lord of Hosts, I am part of an army, victorious, blessed, and righteous. All right. Nia, Nia. We are blessed. We're part of a team. I love that. What do you think about your part? of an army, like we belong. We're not by ourselves, right? Like we're part of an army. Add it, jump if you want, we'll be here. He is the Lord of hosts. We are part of an army. We're victorious, blessed, and righteous. Got it, okay, 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two. All right, you got two more moves. Burpee, two kicks. We got our sit ups, our rocking sit ups. We're done. All right, you pick wall, step or jump it out. Here we go. Two kicks. You're doing great. You're doing great. No matter how you're moving, whatever option you're picking, you're moving, you're doing it right. You're doing a great thing. Take care of your body, the body that God's giving you. All right, keep moving. I'm gonna turn so I can see my notebook here. Your next name of God, and I don't even know how to say it, so I'm gonna say what it means. It's maker. Yeah, it starts with Yahweh, and I have no idea how to say that word, but it means maker and because he is the maker i am created go ahead and break i am created designed and formed for his glory go ahead and get your mat up on down we got one more move we got five seconds to get there remember your option with the sit up you can be here leg out foot on the ground come on up or roll those feet up touch your toes your hips up off the ground, touch your toes. Because he is the maker, I am created, designed, and formed for his glory. I love this one because it's the heart of our message at Whole Fit. It's that you were created for purpose on purpose. You're created on purpose for purpose, for his glory, not your glory. So we get to take care of this body that God's given us. So we can give him glory. Strengthen the muscles, the lungs, the heart to do what he's calling us to do. To serve and love those around us. Keep his body healthy. He got 10 seconds. Right? We're not going after a certain image. We already have an image. We're made in his image, right? Oh, just let your feet fall to the ground. Bring your hands above your head. Arm. Stretch out, legs stretch out, stay there. I'm gonna turn off this high intensity music. This is not relaxing. Okay, all right, go ahead and stay there. Come on down to your mat, or stay on your mat. I'm coming down to my mat. Go ahead, hug your knees. You did it. Give yourself a big hug. Go ahead and rock side to side with those knees. Oh, great job. All right, we're gonna take our arms out wide. 
and bring your legs up as if they were on the wall, just feeling that blood drain down your legs, hold it here, inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth. Do that again. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Go ahead and bring your right foot down, left foot down, and you're just gonna rock side to side. Windshield wipe, like little windshield wipers. Rock your knee side to side, and if one side feels like it just needs you to stay there, be there, listen to your body. Um, honor that and stretch it out. All right, come back to the center. We're gonna rock all the way over. We're gonna come to our hands and our knees. Tuck your toes. If it's okay on your feet, go ahead and sit back on your heels, stretching out the bottom of your feet, but also the top of the legs. Lean back, look up. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Come back to your hands and your knees. Go ahead and um, untuck your toes. Round your back, inhale, and then exhale, and look up. Let's do that again. Inhale, round your back. Exhale, flat back, and look up. We're going to go to our child's pose, toes together, knees out, hands out in front, and just drop your head on your mat, sit it back, hold it here. We're going to come to a seated position. Go ahead and take your right leg out, left foot in. We're going to stretch, bring that left arm up and over, feeling the stretch in the side. Hold it here for a few seconds. And then we're going to turn, face your foot, hold it here. Go ahead and twist, look over that left shoulder. Going back to what A.W. Tozer said in his book, Knowledge of the Holy. Go ahead and switch your legs, other side. What comes into our minds when we think about God is the most important thing about us. So just think for a moment here. What comes to your mind when you think about God? But also, what do you think about God during the day in those everyday moments? And turn here. Like, do you struggle believing that God is with you, that He sees you, that He's for you? Like, we may have our minds, which is great, may pop in our head real quick, like, oh, this is who He is, this is who He is. But do we live in that reality throughout our day? Go ahead and twist, look over your right shoulder, sitting tall. Go ahead and cross your legs. I'm going to go through these names one more time. One more stretch here up of the chest. Elohim, creator, ruler, God. Because he is the creator, ruler, God, I am created, sustained, and ruled. Go ahead and shake out your hands. Just relax. You can close your eyes, arms open, whatever you feel comfortable with, or lay back down as I continue to read. He is Yahweh. The self-existing I am. Because he is Yahweh, I'm chosen, dependent, changeable. El Elion, God most high, possessor of heaven and earth, because this is who he is. I have royalty, I am victorious. El Shaddai, God Almighty, God of blessing and power. Because he is El Shaddai, I am sustained, I am blessed, I am provided for. Lord of hosts, because he is Lord of hosts, I am part of an army, victorious, blessed, righteous. Maker, because he is the maker, I am created, designed, and formed for his glory. 
Take a deep breath in, inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. When you hear who he is and who you are because of who he is, how does that change the way you think, feel, and believe? God, thank you that you're patient with us. Thank you for these reminders and God, who you are. God, help us to believe and help our unbelief. God, thank you that um, we are rich because of you. There's so many blessings, God, that you take care of us. You, you've chosen us. you created us. You rule over our life. You sustain us. We're victorious. We're part of your team. God, we just thank you so much. And God, I just think of the last one that we're meditating on today is that you were the maker, that you created, created and designed us and formed us for your glory. So God, I ask that as we go throughout our day, give us eyes to see you um, as we bump into people, work, along, work alongside of people, serve one another. God, help us to do it for your glory. Help us to love the body in a healthy whole way that you gave us, honor it, and um, because we want to take care of the body that you give us, not in a self-seeking or self-worshipping way, but to worship you. So God, we want to honor you and give you glory. Help us to do that in Jesus.